The wait is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Liverpool, they take on Borussia Dortmund and the action is next on EA TV Live. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It is Liverpool against Borussia Dortmund. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. So, the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson begins in goal. Trent Alexander Arnold starts with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Fabinho plays with Jordan Henderson in the centre of the pitch. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and then it's a pretty tidy finish too. Hits it hard, he hits it low, and it just makes it difficult for the keeper. A really nice goal. Well, as they restart the game, how will Borussia Dortmund reply to that setback? Luis Diaz. Andrew Robertson getting forward and crossing towards the far post and there it is a two goal cushion now and just look at these fans the trophy coming their way surely Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So, 2-0 now. Mini-8. Good use of advantage for Dortmund. Dahoud, an alert intervention, Salah, and the pass could do damage, and pushed away to safety, and that will be a corner, well the referee deciding to let the play flow, but now it will be a booking Stuart, well as soon as the ball went dead he was always going to book him, and he's absolutely right to do so, Trying to pick out a teammate. A decisive clearance it was. Salah. Surely. And a goal. Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why he's upset. He got something on it, but not enough to keep it out. That's frustrating for a keeper. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Daniel Malin. Sebastian Allaire. Went in strongly to win the ball. Nunez Henderson 
Henderson. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He's beaten far too easily on that occasion. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. Rice. Oh, super piece of play. Opportunity to deliver the cross. But options at the back post here. It didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Well, there you have it. Liverpool have controlled most of the possession and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football and they look like scoring more. Fine sequence of passes. Salah. Alexander-Arnold. Firmino. Henderson. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. It's a short one. It's one corner after another. And he's fired over the corner. Well, nothing comes of it. Bellingham. Daniel Malin. Brandt with it. Advantage, Borussia Dortmund. He's got the right idea with that pass. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, let's take another look, and I'm not sure what the keeper was thinking there. Just look at his position. He made it far too easy for him to score. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League. Oh, it was a terrible-looking challenge and a big decision for the official here. And there it is, a red card, and everything was going mostly to plan. Well, it shouldn't affect the result, but it ruins what has been a very good performance. Spot on with that tackle. A bit of running room now on the wing. And space for the cross. Clattered away. Sebastian Allaire. It's with Dahoud. And he likes to run at them. Daniel Malin. Guerrero. Crossing into the middle. And the keeper making sure that there were no scraps to feed on for the attackers. Tahoud takes on the shot. And a really good diving stop. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Delivering it. It's an effective clearance. Allaire. And he did so well to move across and deal with the danger.
who's going to get on the end of it any goalkeeper would accept corner kick deliveries like that every day well, we're into the final half hour and breaking at pace with Menace and Thiago another goal the lead grows to four now a rampant display Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Dahoud. Great opportunity. And this time it's in. Fabulous goal, and just look at the celebrations. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Salah. A disadvantage Liverpool here. Andrew Robertson. It's with Fabinho. Luis Diaz. Darwin Nunez. Oh, he's really opened them up here. And a goal to seal the hat trick. A master class in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, here's the goal again, and you have to say the patience of the passing is outstanding. They're just waiting for the right time to penetrate, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. And he's taken it away. Well, that is how to run at defenders. And Mohamed Salah now. A gift for any goalkeeper. Minier. Well, nearly at full time. Not quite. And it's all going Liverpool's way, Stuart. Well, what can you say about this performance? They've been absolutely brilliant. They've played with such guile and creativity and their passing has been so expansive. Not many teams would have stopped them today. Nunez. Cuts in from the flank. Able to get a body in the way. Axel Witzel. Torgan Azar. Brandt, Aller, here's Royce, possession one, so two minutes of stoppage time here, Virgil van Dijk, and Diaz has it. England's most successful European club have done it again. Liverpool, the winners of the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation 
of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The kings of European club football, Liverpool. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone... Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.